Hey everyone, welcome back, Keith Floor 1x5 Games, and today we have a very special Magic Monday going on. We have our final Standard Showdown. Now, I've been doing Standard Showdown, God, it feels like a year now, um, and I try to do one a month, and of course, uh, chasing down some of these packs took me a little bit longer than I was hoping for, but here we are. This is it. This is the final set before they went into just the promo packs all right so nowadays you can get the uh of course you know wizards of the coast they have to go overboard they went with the not only do they do a standard promo pack but they have to do a premium promo pack as well and those can get a little bit costly I have been trying to keep up with those a little bit better, um, but again, it still takes some time <clears throat> to just get everything in order before I can start showing it. So, with that being said, we will have Ikoria soon, uh, the Lair of the Behemoths, we will be having that really soon here. Let's see, we got Seraph of the Scales. And does this come with a promo? It does have a promo card, so it's a spirit card. We've got the rules. And then we have the divider. I'm trying to organize everything. Jeez, everything's all messed up already. Let me move these out of the way. All right. So... That's good enough, right? And yeah, I forgot to check the serial numbers, which I love to do for no, no damn reason. Anyways, I'll be doing Ikoria, I hope, next month. Actually, no, I have everything. I just got, I got the final packs. Did I? I think so. I think I got the final packs this week. Fairy Duelist. Gore Clan Wrecker. And of course we're looking for Shock Lands in this set. Footlight Fiend and Smothering Tithe Tithing because apparently that card jumped up. Blade Brand. Titanic Brawl. Growth Spiral. Exposed to Daylight. And then we got the Fire Wheeler. With eyes everywhere. Oh god, they got the, the dual cards, Collision, Colossus, and Glass of the Guild Pack. And the Azorius Guild Gate. Not off to the best start. <laughs> but anyways, uh, yeah, so what I'll do, uh, like I said, this will be the last Standard Showdown video I do. And I'll be moving forward, and I've already been doing the... The new promo packs. I'm just gonna keep doing that going forward. And we'll have Icoria next month. I'm way behind on 20 uh, core 2021 though. I don't know what to do because I've been thinking about just saving my money. They got the double masters and then now they have uh who is it? Uh you know Zendikar is coming up soon and I really want to get like a whole case for that so we'll see. Acrobat, Clan Guild Mage, Junk Troller, and Unbreakable Formation. And Simic Guild Gate. So we'll have to see if I could sell some more cards and fund it. That's that's really what it boils down to. I need to be able to fund all of this stuff. Quench, Rebel Slinger. Thirsting Shade, Stony Strength, Embrace, Hybrid, Final Payment, Ill-Gotten Inheritance. See, I want to see that in foil. That looks really awesome. Clear the Stage, uh, Terramander, Blood Mist, Infiltrator, and our very first Mythic, Rakdos the Showstopper. And our very first foil, too. Let's slam it on the knife. Blade Brand. Alright. 
we have a long way to go to get through this, so let's start skipping the comments, shall we? You know, some people say, oh, you know, comments. I think uh, Rudy had a phrase, something about the commons. Life is too short for commons or some something like that. Windstorm Drake, Gatebreaker Ram, Smeltward Ignis, and our second mythic, nice, Spawn of Mayhem. It's a freaking brilliant mythic there. Two mythics in this pre-release. Um, and then, of course, you get to some of the Zendikar sets, and there's a map, and... God, what was the other... Like, some of the adventure stuff. That stuff has climbed quite a bit. There's a locket. We have Lizrog. Junk Troller. Sentinel's Mark. I hope Junk Troller's worth, like, five bucks, because I got two of them so far. And our first Shockland Blood Crypt. Perfect. We will be putting those lands aside. As everyone knows, I do collect lands, though I'm pretty sure I have all of these. I'm pretty sure I have the full set. But you never know. I'm constantly having to go through my my collection to see what I got. Alright, so I got two there. Almost like an audit. You know, you gotta audit your collection every once in a while. Got our... What do we got? Rampage of the Clans. And then of course we have... It feels like there's something else in this box. No, oh, no, it's just a the, uh, insert that raises the dice. Or die. I hope everyone's having a fantastic Monday. I can tell you right now, I'm not taping this on Monday. I do have a day job, so I do tape these uh, a day or two in advance. But, I don't know. I don't have kids this weekend, so I'm br or this week. So I'm kind of excited. Oh, I forgot I was supposed to skip through those. I'm kind of excited to just kind of chill with the wife, you know? Let's get some downtime for a little bit. Rhythm of the Wild, Regenesis, Syndicate Guild Mage, and a Verity Circle. A Verity Circle? I'll take your word for it. Hey, let me know in the comments, do you guys actually collect these sets? Because, I mean, to me it seems like it would be uh, quite the task to collect all of these cards. Just curious. Senate Guildmage. Enraged Ceratok. Every once in a while it looks kind of fuzzy up in the top to me. Forbidding Spirit. Uh, Warrant and Warden. And a Gruel. Guild Gate. Oh, was that a rare? It is. Okay. Did not catch that. So, definitely look forward to some downtime while the kids are with their other parents. We get to chillax a little. Archway Angel. Fire Blade Artist. Rumbling Ruin. And end raise forerunners. Why does it feel like I'm not getting all my Hmm. It kind of felt like I wasn't getting all my uncommons there. I guess that's what happens when you skip all the commons. You're like, oh kind of cut through it a little bit faster. I do love all the lockets. I don't know if uh, Lindsay Look has anything in here. Bulric. Clan Crusher, Wayfinder, Scabbling Claws, Simic Ascendancy, Simic Guildgate. I know if I want to build my audience, I gotta start saying really stupid shit. That will help. If 
I just say really goofy things here and there. Ah, Cynic Locket. Yeah, it's still not Lindsay. Light up the stage. That's a pretty good one. Spire Mangler. Spirit of the Spires. Holy shit. Spawn of Mayhem again. Two Spawn of Mayhems. I hope he's worth 20 bucks each. That'd be awesome. I kind of flipped my shit. <laughs> He'd be up on eBay in five minutes, let me tell you. Roll the die. Ooh. Oh, man. We got two sixes. Shit. Maybe we'll get the number of the beast. The code cards will go up on eBay. Zagana Utopian Speaker. Awesome foil there. Because that's the way I am. The magic codes really help out. They help uh, fund the next set, if you will. So hopefully we'll get enough money out of this opening to maybe catch up with 2021. Bulrak Clan Crasher. Guardian of Spire Mangler. He's an insect. Uh, Was he just a giant ass insect going after a dove? And a Spellbreaker. Ooh, and one of the lockets. A foil Azorius locket. So far, only one uh, Shock Land, so I'm kind of shocked. Feral Maka. Damn, Lockets light up the stage again. Wilderness Reclamation, Clan Guild Mage, and Unbreakable Formation again. I wonder if they have a limited set of rares and uncommons that they put into the pre release. That probably doesn't make much sense to do. I don't know. To me, if you limit it so that they're not overly powerful. Bankrupt in Blood. Uh, Bell Haunt. Code of Constraint. Okay, I see they're constraining that dude. Sphinx of Foresight. Oh, and a foil. Flames of the Raised Boar. Oil. That's one thing about Magic Man. For the most part, when they do foil, they do foil right. And these cards are really nice. Like, I know the quality has gone down some here and there, but these ones are pretty nice. We got a Pontiff. Cavalcade of Calamity. Combined Guild Mage. Glass of the Guild Pack. And you can tell I'm quite sober because I can actually pronounce most of this shit. Not too bad for being sober. Hack Hackrobat. What the hell kind of stupid ass name is that? I mean, I get it, it's a play on Acrobat, but what's the hacking part? They all want to see me fall. Skatewing Spy, Knight of the Last Breath, Tithe Taker. Ooh. And then we got the Zagonian, or er, <laughs> Zagana Utopian Speaker, which we got the promo and this beautiful foil. And it's a foil rare. Even better. Final pre release. Pack, as they call it. We're gonna open this and then we're gonna go ahead and do the standard showdown pack. Because those are pretty damn exciting usually. Eight. And yeah, this is a double, so. Oh, but I did get a different one. Simic Ascendancy. I do keep all of these promos, believe it or not. I have a whole freaking box full of them. 
I don't know, I just put them aside. I actually take them out of the package, put them aside, and, you know, maybe one day when I die, they're, they're worth something. Or not, who knows. The way the market's been going, jeez. We got a Wayfinder. Wilderness Reclamation, Combined Guild Mage, and Tithe Taker. Man, I really hope some of these cards are worth something because I'm getting a lot of them. Now with that out of the way, I can kind of move, spread out my stacks. Only one shock land so far. So we need a lot more to catch up. I want to say I already opened a box of this too in the past. But it's been so long. I'm just happy to get these damn things off my shelf. Oh, come on, camera. What the hell are you doing? Because honestly, they've been sitting on my shelf for well over a year now. Frilled Mystic. Clamor Shaman. Shaman? Cry of the... Whatever. And then, alright, we got another shock land. Hollowed Fountain. And that's a rare. Nice. So awesome. I love the lands. But anyways, I was doing all of these in order. I was trying to keep it in order. And so it, it caused a little headache there. Gates of Blaze, because I was waiting on the last one for almost six months, thanks to frickin' the disease. The unmentionable disease. Finally, we were able to break that loose, and here we go. Final standard showdown. It's kind of sad in a way. Uh, Saratok, 10 Street Dodger. <laughs> That's cool. And Bedeck to Bedazzle, and a Gate Colossus Foil. Final pack. You know, this, this box and the first one were pretty dope. Anytime you get a shock land in a box, that's awesome. Rhythm of the Wild, Spire Mangler again, Sky Tether, and Cinder Vines. Kind of reminds me of Cinder Ace in Pokemon. Don't tell anyone I said that. Alright, Standard Showdown. Was it? There's got to be. Gosh, I want to say four cards, maybe? Maybe five. Maybe there's five in here. Let's check it out. Get right to it. Okay, Dominaria, Grand Warlord, Radha, M19, Dragon's Horde. Oh, okay, they're both rares. Ooh, Planes, Promo, Foil. Love that foiling too. I love the architecture in the back, to be honest. Oh, chart of course. Okay, that's a nice one. And so, yeah. So, that was four cards. Not too shabby. Let's go ahead and go to the open, or the loose packs here. Do we have any that are the same? Nope. I don't even know where these came from. That's how long it's been. I have not a clue. We're going to Geyer Engineer, so that's cool. That's a different card that we haven't seen. We have seen the Ceratoc though, in the code. Ooh, but we haven't seen Kaya's Wrath. Pretty sure that's worth a buck or two. Come on, baby, we need one more shock land and one more mythic to make my day. Senate Guild Mage, Angelic Exaltation, Sentinel's Mark. Oh, hell yeah, there we go, baby. We got Kaya, the Ursurper. Er 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 nice, that is a freaking beautiful mythic. Pim, mythic. <laughs> That is a gorgeous mythic right there. Planeswalker can't beat them. 
Oh shit, and we got, oh my, <coughs> damn, we got Tessa Karlov foil, wow, that was a freaking, that was a bomb ass pack right there, the only thing that could top that would be one of the other Shocklands, whew, alright, what do we got? Come on, baby, give me a shock land. We got deploy, oh, depose and deploy. A <laughs> vindictive vampire. No one likes a freaking vindictive vampire, right? In theory, the guild pack keeps the guild feuds from spiraling out of control. Personal feuds, however, are not covered. Okay. 10th Street Dodger again. And a mirror march. That's cool. I don't think I've seen that one. final loose pack and then we get into the fat pack fat packs are always kind of my favorite same with the uh, elite trainer boxes for for uh, Pokemon those are pretty cool too high alert biogenic upgrade graveling claws oh font of agonies all right I'm sure you cannot sense my disappointment there. I try to hide it so well. I still need to get a sharper knife though, jeez. One day that blade's gonna snap. I'm trying to do this without dumping this on the cards. Let's see here, how am I gonna do this? We're going to do... shit. We got the Don't Steal Me tab. Get rid of that shit. Okay, where where the hell am I gonna put this damn thing? I just have to put it right there. I can barely make it out in the corner. We have our book, our booklet of facts, player's guide. And let's see what we got for art. Art. Very, very dramatic. Actually, it's pretty. Kind of, uh, it's all right. I personally, I love architecture. If you don't know, I build a lot of Lego. I shouldn't say a lot. I haven't built a lot lately, but uh, my my thing for Lego is architecture. That's like my favorite. So I love doing that. So we got, uh, you know, we'll talk about the Colts, different cards, blah, blah, blah. These are pretty cool though. I do like these booklets and I save them all. One day I'll likely get rid of them as they continue to take up storage. There we go. There's all the shock lands that we're after. Blood Crypt, Godless Shrine, Gateway Plaza. Yeah, that's what we need. We need some more of those shock lands. So let's get to it. Oh, we got a white die this time. Maybe I haven't opened this. 14. We have, should be 10, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 packs. Out of the way so I can maneuver around. We got a uh, stack of looks like foil lands, a package of those, and then we have learning the basic building your decks, that type of crap. And these serial numbers, they're all the same. And you can probably hear Biggie snoring his ass off in the hallway. I got the door open today. It's just me and Biggs. Me and Biggie today just chilling. He's sleeping. I'm working. I'm working on this. Ooh, Rakdos locked it. Lock it. Wayfinder. Finding his way. We got the Clan Crusher. Not sure what, why the hell he's hitting the gate there. Blood Mist Infiltrator. 
And Nikia of the old ways. She used to be worth a buck or two. Not sure she is anymore. I say she, but I only say that because it looks like she has a top on. A halter top. I'm assuming she is covering some female anatomy there. We have Oh shit, I kinda jumped there. Shark Sharkdo crab. Love that guy. It's like, what are we gonna do? Just put a bunch of shit together. We got a shaman. Regenesis. Bedeckin Bedazzle. Damn, no shock land, so. Just put that on the wrong. These packs are kinda crushed. No damage to the cards, that's good. Arch Archway Angel. Drill bit. Oh hell no. Oh what the hell is that? Holy shit, dude. That is it says never boring is the flavor to what the hell? Sidhar Shatter How the hell I cannot pronounce your name, dude. Sidharth Chattervetti? Whoa, dude, that's freaking. That's going in my binder, dude. That is freaking creepy as hell. Ooh, Smothering Tithe. There we go. That's actually like $15 card, believe it or not. I never thought that card would go anywhere. Drill Bit, though. Oh, hell yeah. That's dope, bro. You're a sick bastard. I'll have to follow you on Instagram. I like all those horror drawings and shit on Instagram. They're cool. They're creepy and cool. And Senate Guild Mage. Sky Tether. Yeah, yeah. Say Sky Guard. Yeah, yeah. Unbreakable Formation. This card better be worth like five bucks because I got three of them now. These will definitely be on sale very soon on my eBay. Scully, S-K-U-L-L-Y underscore 1X5 Games. Senate Guild Mage. Swirling Torrent. Macabre Mockery. And Awaken the Erstwhile. Still. We need another Mythic, bro. Another Mythic, another Shockland. That's what I want. One of each would be awesome. Let's see. Come on, let's get it. Send me some luck through that damn camera, would you? Through the video. All right, there you go. That was a good omen, right? Sharkdo Crab. Code of Constraint. Dovin's Acuity. And Judith, the Scourge Diva. Okay. So it's Britney Spears in Hell? Is that what we're talking about? Come on, baby. We only got a few more packs here. Not even a handful. We're about to hit the 30 minute mark too. We got... Biggie, can you keep it down, bro? Like some of us are trying to stay awake. Consecrate and consume. Troll Bread Guardian. Oh, Resolute Watchdog. Okay, that's cool. And Immolation Shaman. So that was not a good omen. Three more packs. Oh, we got Screaming Shield. Cool. <laughs> that would freak me the hell out. Ah! Don't hit me! Ah! Windstorm Drake. Uh, Infiltrator and Growth Chamber Guardian. Ooh, and a 10th District Veteran. She's shiny. Two more packs. We're just barely gonna go over 30 minutes. Long ass video. Oh, we got the Sarah talk again. Hello, old friend. Ministrant of Obligation. Okay. We got the tor Torrent. Oh, Plaza of Harmony. Wait, that's not a shock land, though. 
That's pretty dope. That's a dope card, though. You gain three life if you control two or more gates. That, that's a pretty dope card. Final pack, everyone. Come on, send me that luck. Send me the luck. I need it. One more Shockland and one more Mythic. What if it's a what if it's a mythic shockland? Don't snore at me, bro. That's not nice. We got our Arcway Angel. Archway Mortify. Alright. Carnival of Carnage. Alright, so that that always uh makes me think of ICP. And Biomancer's Familiar. Creepy little bastard. Oh, shit. That would have been so cool if it was a foil land, but it's not. Incubation Druid foil, but it is a rare, so that's cool. All right, folks, that's it. Our final standard showdown, and what a ride it's been. It's been absolutely fun. I'm going to set this up in the folder and the sit set so you can go back and check out all the wackiness over the past year. Really appreciate your support. Don't forget to subscribe. Please check out some of my other videos. You can smash that damn like button all you want to. If you really want to. Catch me on Instagram. At 1x5games. Until next time. Cheers.